Hey guys, uh, I saw where Andrew Ballina had posted a Daniel Harris video going through all these movies with Daniel Harris in it. I thought it was a pretty cool idea because she's my favorite actress. Um, he originally did it for The Horror Man and uh, they're both really cool dudes. They both seem to be really cool. You should really subscribe to them if you're not subscribed already. They're awesome guys. But uh, anyway, let's go ahead and get started. First off, I have Chrome Skull, Laid to Rest 2. It's uh, made by Robert Hall. It's a pretty good one. I, I, I enjoyed it, and I enjoyed the the first one too, just Laid to Rest. It's pretty cool. Next, we have uh, what she's probably best known for is Halloween 4. Um, as we know, this is the first return to Michael Myers after Halloween 2. And she's after, of course, Jamie Lloyd, which is Daniel Harris's character. Next we have Halloween 5, really cool movie, um, I kind of feel like it didn't get as much credit as it should, like it's not the best one in the series, but it's still definitely a good entry into the franchise, I feel like, and uh, she does a great job for a kid, it's just really amazing. Next is Urban Legend, I really love this movie, this movie is really intelligent, I think, um, it's a cool concept, really cool idea. I think they did a pretty good job with it. She plays the roommate of the main character. It's really an odd role for Danielle Harris, but she plays it to like an awesome way, so you know, you gotta love it. Next we have Rob Zombie's Halloween, which, you know, really surprised me. Whenever I first heard about the remake, I was all like, uh... Why would you even touch Halloween? It's the greatest horror movie ever made. And then... He surprised me with it. I actually enjoyed it. Uh, she plays Nancy Loomis' character from the original Halloween. And I think that she does a really great job. Then on to Halloween 2. Rob Zombie's Halloween 2. This movie sucks. Like, I am not a fan of this movie at all. I think that Rob Zombie just lost all direction... He had something good going for the first one, but he couldn't really keep up the momentum, but whatever. Anyway, I still like Daniel Harris' character in this one. She's probably, like, my favorite character in the movie. I like Scout Taylor Compton's character as well, but I don't know. just not that good of a movie, period. And last, we have Hatchet 2. Hatchet 2 is a great movie. I love Hatchet, to be honest. It's one of my favorite franchises. I think it's great new slashers. Um, I'm ready for Hatchet 3. I think it's going to be awesome. And uh, I'm just pumped, man. You should really check it out if you haven't seen it. Just over the top, fun, cheese fest. It's awesome. I also have uh, Daniel Harris autograph right there. And... Danielle Harris signature right there. So, that's my collection. Uh, if you like it, subscribe. Leave comments. Thanks.